Hello guys, I have a band-aid on my face. Are they called Starry Strips? They're like nude and they're breathable. So, um, my laser thing, it's healing, but what happened is that, um, well, what, what happened is not what at all what we were expecting to happen. We thought it would just turn red, like most people's skin at my age does. But because of the microneedling we've been doing and my skin was already like healing underneath, because of all that, when we did the laser, my skin took it as like a really, really, really bad burn. So it started like oozing and pussing and then overnight it started getting crusty with like blisters and it just hasn't been cute at all. But um, my PA has been like great and I went to go see her again today. She gave me some of these um, band-aid things to cover it up because I need something to be able to go to work tomorrow and on Wednesday. So it's been um, a healing process. We had no idea this would happen. Like this is something that normally happens with people who have like older skin. Um, but for me, it happened because we were already doing like the microneedling and we did the laser like a week later. Um, yeah, so this happened. Like I'm not even upset about it. Like once it heals, it's gonna be great and I'm so excited to like see the end result or whatever. It's just dealing with it right now. like. I'm much more comfortable going out with a band-aid but before that like if you guys see like what this looks like underneath like it's just you guys could check out my yesterday's vlog it's pretty much like that but it's like yellow and bubbly and crusty and ugly and it's just not very cute at all so at least these band-aids are helping me <laughs> quite a bit with um confidence right now like um my, my boyfriend's also been super supportive he's like you don't need to wear a band-aid like it doesn't matter like whatever but um i'm just like mm, I, I i would prefer to wear a band-aid <laughs> um the only thing is like had i known that this was gonna happen which neither of us knew that this was gonna happen but had i known i would have waited until like christmas break or something to do it where i have like some more healing time and like time to just like sit at home and do nothing and not have to go anywhere and go to work and stuff but you know it happened like whatever the story strips are working fantastic and I will I will deal with that and live with that but yeah there's my update for you guys I do also have like quite a bit of a headache today and I don't know why um I don't I don't think these are gonna come off I'm afraid they're gonna come off like should I take some spare ones I don't think they're gonna come off but you know what just to be on the safe side I'm gonna take some spare ones I was quite crafty this morning after I went to the doctor. So my first thing this morning was the doctor um, at 10 a.m., the PA rather, and I had to be there. She helped me, um, told me what to do to take care of it, gave me the band-aids. Um, she took off like some of like the crustiness, but it started coming back. But the reason she took it off is so that the skin could like heal underneath rather than having like that layer on top preventing it from healing fast enough but she was like don't do that at home I was like no I'm not like touching it at home at all but anyway so I got home and I've been crafty since I made this for my boyfriend for our six month anniversary guys this is like the cutest thing ever like I don't know like I feel like when you truly love somebody you just want to make stuff for them and let them know like how much you love them when you really love somebody you want to tell them in as many ways as possible and i love just making crafty stuff i think it's so much more meaningful than getting something um like buying something i still bought him something too but i think crafty like putting all that time and love into it is just so much more meaningful and i feel like when you really have that person that you like truly, truly love and you're like in a happy relationship, like for me as a crafty person, I just wanna get crafty and like make things. I don't know. That's just, uh, that's just like a little rant, but this little heart album is like so cute and I'm gonna give it to him today even though our anniversary is not until Saturday, but I'm gonna hope, I'm hoping his other part of his gift is gonna arrive by then for me to give it to him. But um, yeah, I'm gonna give this to him now. Oh, well, I'm on my way to go to his house and I'm gonna give it to him. Hey guys, happy Thanksgiving. Today's Thanksgiving. I was so busy this morning. I prepared all my clothes for the week because I'll be away this weekend, uh, leaving tomorrow at like 5 a.m. Going to Cape Cod. 
Um, and I was icing cupcakes this morning and finishing up the sweet potato thing, putting the marshmallows on top. Then I was doing a whole bunch of Etsy orders because I wanted those mailed out tomorrow so my mom could send them to, take them to the post office while I'm on my way to Cape Cod. Like I leave five o'clock in the morning tomorrow and I don't get back until Sunday night around 10 p.m. So I like really don't have time to do anything. I had so much to do today. I still have to pack for Cape Cod. That's the last thing I have to do, but I'm just gonna have to do that like later, like when I get home from Thanksgiving, cause I just, I didn't have time. I ran out of time. Anyway, I'm showing you guys my outfit. This is what I wore for like the past three years in a row, this dress. Um, so I'm just wearing this. I'm gonna wear like some brown boots and I did my makeup or tried to. I couldn't really do foundation cause this is Band-Aid on here. Um, but I tried to do a little bit of blush like around it, a little bit of powder. I did uh, on my lip, I have Kylie Jenner pumpkin. Um, I did a little bit on my eyes, just the gold kind of signature Carolina look. So I have that. My hair is not cooperating and I don't like it, but um, can't do anything because I gotta go now. I'm supposed to be at Dom's house in about half an hour and it takes me about half an hour to get there. Actually, I have 23 minutes and it takes me about half an hour to get there, so I might be a little late. They told me not to bring anything, but I feel really weird about not bringing anything. I do not like being empty handed, but like I literally asked his mom, can I bring this, can I bring that? But like, we're not gonna be there for a dessert because we're gonna be at my sister's house then. And she was like, no, blah, blah, blah. And I just, I feel terrible. And yeah, not cool. But I'm excited for the Christmas lights to go on because they put up their Christmas lights at 5 p.m. today on Thanksgiving. So I'm excited to see that they put them on and then it's gonna be on until like Christmas and I think like a week after or something. I'm so excited to see that at some point today I still have to stop by um, CVS and get a bag I have a Dom's six month anniversary gift so I gave him the card that I made he didn't want it to be on a vlog so I didn't show it on a vlog but he loved it um, he liked it a lot so I did give that to him but I also got him um, Islanders hats and a hoodie because he wanted one we're also going to Islanders game on December 1st I think it is so this is one of the hats I didn't know if he would want like a pom-pom or like a fold over so I got like a straight hat he said he lost his so I really didn't know what kind of hat to get then I also got him this hat I really like this one it's like a fold over on the bottom and it has a pom-pom so cute this one's from Amazon then I also got him a hoodie an Islanders hoodie and I hope he likes it and I hope that actually fits and then, just for fun, because he likes hockey, I got him this mug. This is from Amazon. I'll link it down below. But it's a mug where he could play hockey. Not hockey. Hockey, yeah. Golf. No, hockey. No. What am I saying? Golf. This is golf. That's hockey. The Islander stuff is hockey. This is golf. Um, so he could play golf while he's just like sipping on a cup of coffee. I think it was just like, it was just like so fun. I saw it and I was like, yes, like why not? So... I thought I would get that for him as well. Um, so that's my uh, six month anniversary gift for my babe. I knew, I know he needed a hat, so wanted to get him something that's gonna be useful and that he's gonna use.